shift here. <clears throat> Back post analysis. Let's save Grandpa. Last episode we did, we, we made some games. We made lots of games. They were beautiful and everyone loved them. And in this episode, we're gonna continue to make the video games. Uh, Star Games gave gave it an eight. Adventure Games were on G64. Um, research new topic, and we have we have enough, so we're gonna research the custom engine. And this will let us implement new and slash more features. And I'm gonna slap my hand. So I got some robin eggs, delicious robin eggs that I want to eat. But I don't want to be crunching on them because it'd be loud. So actually research to catch the mention. Game tutorials and mono sound. So we're gonna go ahead and research. We're gonna we don't have enough, so we're gonna we're gonna make another game real quick. We're gonna develop a new game. We're gonna pick topic. History, strategy. For the PC, history sh history strategy game. Country, oh, God dang, I can't spell. World, world power, world powers, battle, world powers battle. Game of World Powers. Powers. World Powers. Good enough. My very creative names. Well, actually, no, I don't, I don't think I've made a strategy game in a while. Dude, Race to Save Grandpa, though. It's doing really good. Level design is very important. Dialogue is probably something like that. More me about like that. Something like that. <clears throat> Race to Save Grandpa. Recent studies suggest that increasing variety of game devices also creates market for more specialized gaming. Some platforms become more popular with younger groups. And target audience. We, we need to get target audience soon. Sounds important. World design is probably pretty important. Graphics aren't very important. How about something like... Something like that? Don't forget your custom engine. We will do that. Um... Oh, wait. Before we... Let's look at game history real quick. Let's just say Grandpa. So top ranking 10. Made a good profit. 230.1k. That's pretty good. We got the bugs out. Oh, would Vena. Japanese company. I actually don't. I'm sorry. I don't know what that one is. Like Sega-esque, I think. But I don't know. The Genesis. That's how much of a game fan I am. Alright, so let's generate a report. I'm terrified this game is going to be garbage. Okay. Okay! <laughs> All games, you sack of trash. I hate you. I'm sink. Let it sink in. 10 out of 10. Star Games, best of its kind. 10 out of 10 informed games, by God. Their focus on world design served the game very well. Game here. I can't wait for the sequel. 9 out of 10. All games. May your mother be cursed, all games. Stealing my 10 out of 10. World Powers was going to be the best. <gasps> it even was rank 1. It was rank 1. Not yet. It was rank 1. And they're like, ah, yeah. All games. <laughs> Game tutorial. Research the game tutorials. 
You've already said sold ticket. It's still rank one. Give us the one thing. Why you do this? All games, you satanic creature. <gasps> World powers the new game by PhD Productions. Cast a storm of good reviews. Excited customers. Industry fresh will say that World Powers is one of the rare games that will set the new quality standards for future games. It seems PHP Jackson is doing well with World Powers. World Powers is still rank one. Successfully researched game tutorials. Well, while that thing is rolling, is raking us in. Let's get, uh, let's get this. The Venna. Let's come out. Jeez, it's still rank one. My god, this thing is just like money, money, money. Oh, it's rank two now, finally. Okay, target items. Now let us um create custom game engine. 2D graphics, learn your story, save game and game tutorials. We're gonna name this P PhD Power Punch. Great game engine. And he's just gonna little fart little bubbles under the remaining. You got that game did amazing. It's off the market. All right, let's. We need it. We need to check. A 9.75. All games burn. So it cost us 31k. Income was 2.2 million. Oh my god, 2.2. I'm just flipping through. That is literally more than all of our other games have made collectively. Dear God, we need to remember this. Write this down, people. We need to make a World Powers 2. Battle for Battle Town. We, the PhD Power Punch. Alright, so let's develop a game. We're gonna pick a topic. Business. E for everybody. Let's be strategy. Yeah, simulation. Simulation. As you can see, I kind of see mature. Mm -hmm. Relation. You picked up PhD Power Punch. And we're gonna name this business. B business. 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 Business Bros. Stock market. No. No. no, no, no. Business Bros. Wall. Oops. Wall Street Rampage Rampage Wall Street Business Bros Stocks and Bonds Boom 2D V2 graphics all the stops for business bro stocks and bonds. It's supposed to be a play on a uh, Mario and the Luigi's. Well, we want to save game. We want a game tutorial. Stock market is a, a fickle beast. Let's bump this up a smidgen. Something like that. I didn't start my timer. Dear God, we don't know what time it is. May has been released. Give me one second while I check the time. We've been going for eight minutes. So we'll go for another eight minutes. It's actually been nine minutes, but that's okay. Artificial intelligence through the roof. Mm, about right there. That would work well. We'll see how this works out. Okay, world design is less than important. Graphics. Something like that. We'll see how this works out. Business bros. Feel my heart. Business bros. Stocks and bonds. To the top. Uh, recently released game cast of Master Vinny stood up the market bull. But did you say this council is not very well marked in North America? But will flourish in other parts of the world. Mm hmm. Indeed. Let's finish this game. We have 2 mil in the bank. 2.5 mil. We level 11 gameplay. We got a ton in 2D graphics. A better user experience. Um, would I like to go? Let's go to the next office. We're moving on up. We got 2.5k in the bank. Uh, 
I would like you to train staff management. And he's gonna train while we wait for our business bros to come out. Business bros, stacks and bonds. Business bros, stacks and bonds. 10 out of 10, my new favorite. Awesome, it's for more games. Truly great from Game Hero. 10 out of 10 for everything. Business Pro stocks and bonds. I was about to murder you all games if you said it wasn't. You gotta remain. Achievement get perfect game. Release a game with a clean 10 score. Perfect 10 achievement. So many units getting sold. Look at it, it's flying up. It's piling higher than the US debt. Can I say that and not get taken down? Mm. Hope so. It's a generated game report. <laughs> it's full position. Oh my god, my soda just went all over my nose. Alright, uh, we got some money. I put. 70k. I want game demo. If you're not a fan of PH Productions now, then chances are you'll be after playing this Business Bros, Stocks and Bonds. The core gameplay has really paid off. Summary Best Game Ever by George Lurgan. Longer Game Anova. He had a funny name. Still rank one. We're gods among men. Alright, so we got John Pope. Uh, as you can see. He's kind of middleman. He got some designs, got some technology. He's kind of quirky. He's good at researching. Wants 10k. She's better. She's slower. There's a little bit more research, but she's got a good amount of. Okay. Okay. okay she's pretty good too. Pretty good too. So you saying? One less research. More speed. More design. Less technology with a little You hired Jack Long. Achievement. Famous. Hire someone. Famous. He's famous? New research. Dude, I. Business bros, stocks, and bonds. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna research. Not a medium game. We don't. A hospital. And uh, here's the little bars. These are like your work. The little bar next to my guy. His little computer he's cheapity tapping at. That's like your. um your stress bar slash your your comfortable bar your research casual okay. I'm gonna go ahead and train him what is he kinda bad at? he's kinda bad at technology so go ahead and go with this one cause I haven't done that I just wanna see what it is like complete hospital let's train you game dev all the the G6 Gofador G64 is losing its market. You can't, you can't do it. It's like we're we're doing. We can fill the position, but oh, this is bros now off the market. They didn't really just come off the market. Um, rank two. Let's let's see game history. PC 10 out of 10. Ironically, made us less than world powers. I guess the topic wasn't pretty good. It cost more too. That's what I find weird. I guess it's just a different topic. I guess strategy history is more interesting than business simulator. I don't know. I would have equated it to like like roller coaster tycoon or something. But as you can see by the box I'm highlighting by a uh, Jack Long. This is just they're getting the plus he's getting plus one. I'm getting plus one, he's plus three. This one looks like it's good for research. Alright, so I'm done. So we're gonna research more. We're gonna get a new topic. Alternate history can only be good. Like uh, Wolfenstein, that's coming out. New Wolfenstein, the Game Link. Game Link. I had a game. I still have my original Game Boy. Hit shelves next month. But yeah, Wolfenstein's coming out. All right, so research. Casual games. We don't have the experience. All right, so we're gonna do this, and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do some contract work. Who's design? Um, go with this one. Cause he's good with design, so we should get them design bubbles flying. 
Yeah, we... And it gives us research, too. Oh, come on, come on, buddy. Pop a little another bubble. Now, let's go ahead and do another contract work. And hopefully we'll get two researches. Game link's been released. We did. Alright, well, let's go and develop a new game. Alternate history. Action. Trying to match action? Hmm. This thing's dying out. It's not very good. I wonder if action's good for that. I bet not. I don't know where any action games. So let's not make an action game. What is the game I'm good at? It's good at RPGs. Oh, yeah, we're gonna take the title for the game wing. So we'll go with an RPG. What RPGs topics do we have? RPG alternate history, sure. Game engine with PhD Power Punch. It's gonna be for everyone. RPG alternate history. Hmm. I will I'm gonna cut here, I'm gonna uh, the Baker 24 is talking with them today, and he, I'll uh, go and pause that. It's almost time to go, but I'm going to text him and get a title from him. So I'll see you guys in a bit. What's up, guys? We're back real quick. Title. And I'm going to go ahead and make this last game and then get off. But I'm going to change it, because you can change it at the end, and it won't be named title. Engine's not important. It's RPG quests are quests are pretty important. Honestly, probably about there. Learn your story. Like that. Make sure my phone's not super loud. Break your eardrums. It's not that loud. Level design's pretty important. Useless dialogue's probably dialogue's probably important too. So put it back there. But half. Graphics are important sounds. Yeah. Something like that. Again, don't make many RPGs. Hopefully this one's good. So we're gonna get the bugs out. Finish. New record. Uh, looks like I leveled up, 2D graphics leveled up, graphics leveled up, artificial intelligence, and level design. As you can see, I click up here and I can change it. So, I will now cut to when he texts me. Alright, get the audio. I will up. now cut to when he texts me. Alright, cut to Uh, wait, what? Some end bit where I got the name. Let's check, check this real quick. Very loud computer. Oh, that's weird. It's stuck on the screen. Oh, looks like it wasn't my fault. Looks like the game kind of pooped because I can hear the numbers choosing well that's weird guys I'm sorry uh, that this bug weird happened I'm just kind of showing your screen to show you what happened I don't know but um, I ended up naming the video uh, the thing assassin stopper for the game I'm sorry this bug happened um, and I'll see you guys in the next episode bye